Hey guys, what's up? Doug at Eden Lawn Services. We have a little project we're doing today just to make life a little simpler. Uh, you guys know I've talked about this in the past. This bed and loader is just awesome, man. I mean, it is one awesome tool. You can put 12, 13, 1400 pounds of grass in there and just crank it out and it comes right out. But one of the problems I have with it is this. The grass sometimes gets stacked up and so when you pull it out, it just slides underneath the grass and some of the grass will stay up in the front of the bed. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this old two by four, I'm gonna cut it to length and we're gonna sandwich this in between. And what it's gonna do is it's gonna leave a little shelf up here that uh, catches that grass and pulls it out of the bed. Simple project, quick and easy, so let's do it. Looks like we have exactly 50 inches, 50 inches between the wheel wells. And this two by four is 93 inches. So that'll be just perfect. 46 and a half inches. Perfect. Good it up. Yeah, we did. Ah, we're within an eighth. It's close enough. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to center it on this and we're going to stick this over and we're going to fold it like that and we're going to screw it down and then we're going to wrap it and screw the other one down. That way we can get maximum pulling power without ripping anything out. Like that. That'll work just perfect. All right, we got some screws. First one's always the hardest, right? There we go. I think we just continue along. I'm just gonna stick screws every, I don't know, four or five inches or so. That way we don't get a rip out later. Okay, so there we go. We got it all. We brought it over, flipped it over, and screwed it down. So now it's all, it's well tightened, it's well secure, and hopefully we don't pull it out and rip it. But I don't think we will once we tighten this up. So what we're going to do is we're going to tighten this up against this 2x4, like this. We're going to roll it over. 
got pulling it as tight as we can get it. time like that <clears throat> now we're going to take this two by four and we're going to screw it right to the top just like that got some three inches for this See what we did? So now it's sandwiched in there and it'll have a harder time ripping that because we've got it sandwiched between the two two by fours. And we've created a shelf for the grass to hit. So when you're cranking it out, it'll catch that grass and it should pull it out in theory. So there you go guys, that's how I set it up. I run it all the way forward, up, and on the uh, front of the bed. That way, when you start pulling that stack and the back top of the grass pile falls off, it falls onto the liner and you can pull it out. And it's worked really good. I just needed to get that little shelf on there. There you go. All right, guys, quick, easy little project to make our life a lot simpler. Uh, I'm thinking that's gonna work well. I have seen on YouTube where other people have done the same exact thing. So, and they said it improved uh, greatly on the capacity to get that grass out of that bed. So, uh, there you go. Another quick project, make life simpler, make the season easier. It's better to get it done now rather than wait until we're going a thousand miles an hour mowing lawns. Well, Doug with Eden Lawrence Loves is signing off. See you next time.